Welcome to the Narrow Gate Bantu Cross. Eh? I'm up in Armagh Cathedral, and this is another um, little image above me here. It's the image of the Divine Mercy, and that's how Jesus appeared to a saint called Saint Faustina. And if you look at his heart, and you see the red and the white coming out of his heart, that is the blood of water which goes forth from the heart of Jesus. Blood of water which goes forth from the heart of Jesus as a font of mercy for us. Um, when Jesus' side was pierced, every last drop of blood gushed out and water gushed from his heart. So blood and water which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus, have mercy on us, Lord. And I believe, and this is just my own belief, um, when I pray, there's the church bells ringing again, praise the Lord, bless him. Um, the mercy is flowing out and it's wide open for us to obtain that mercy and grab, and come to know Jesus. Um, that mercy does withdraw, not because Christ has withdrawn his mercy, but if you read the Holy Scriptures and you read the Bible, you know, it starts in Genesis and then finishes in Revelations. And so what I mean, whenever the uh, the mercy, the mercy's there to the last turn of the page, if that makes sense, because the story from the beginning, from Genesis to Revelations, is a continuing story. And so we must uh, um, strive to attain Jesus' love and mercy in these days, in these moments, because because that time will come to an end at some stage of the game as the book of Revelations unfolds and we enter into these here t challenging times that are seemingly upon us. So, um, but again, I'll have another look at the image. It's so beautiful. And there was a, a man that uh, painted that image. I'm not, too, I'm not too sure of his name, to be honest. Um, and he had many, many, many attempts at painting the image. And Saint Faustina probably done his head in a wee bit, um, trying to perfect the image um, of how the Lord was appearing to, to her, and the image of that blood and water which gushed forth from his heart, because um, it, it's a notion of mercy, it's a, a notion of love, and he calls us to repentance and conversion, and to turn to him and truly trust in him. And that's why at the bottom of it says, Jesus, I trust in you. So we put all our faith in the Lord um, because he's our saviour. And we journey along this little life and this little path until the end in Jesus' name, knowing that when we die and take our last breath, that we go before him um, sinful and sorrowful and um, asking him for his love and mercy and forgiveness.